Shanty. Can we go to the moon on vacation? If you think it's tough answering these questions, imagine the ones you'll get if your child is diagnosed with cancer. CureSearch.org can help. It's run by doctors and scientists whose research has led to an overall cure rate of 78%. You're not as alone as you feel. Don't walk. Don't walk. Walk. Do not enter. Hot dogs. Definitely like hot dogs. Motorcycle club. Everything must go. Ghostly ghouls. Don't look at that, Teddy. Body piercing. <laughs> Ouch. Everyday moments can become yeah, teaching right, moments buddy. because learning starts long before school does. Give your child the start they need at bornlearning.org. The bear climbed over the mountain, the bear climbed over the mountain, the bear climbed over the mountain, and what do you think he saw? What do you think he saw? What do you think he saw? The bear climbed over the mountain, the bear climbed over the mountain, the bear climbed over the mountain, and what do you think he saw? outgrown their toddler seat, they're still not ready for adult safety belts alone. Four foot nine is the magic number. Until then, kids need a booster seat. Make sure your little pumpkin gets there safely. Visit BoosterSeat.gov. You're watching Hawthorne Community Television, Channel 22. Quality programming for the city of Hawthorne. Hawthorne locals are staying cool this summer by taking a couple trips to the diving pool. Reporter Karen Matsumoto has more. Hawthorne locals trying to beat the summer heat are learning the art of diving. It's an adrenaline type sport, you know, if you're a skateboarder, a surfer, a BMXer, a motocrosser, this is a sport for you. Students 7 and up who pass beginning level swim classes can learn to dive. Thank you. All right, here we go. Instructors teach proper form and style, including one very important rule. It hurts more when you chicken out. The golden rule of diving is just not to freak out. Just do the whole entire dive and it's not going to hurt even less. When you're in the air and you decide halfway in the air that you don't want to do the dive anymore, usually it results in slamming down and smacking the water either on your belly or on your back or on your face or otherwise. But even with a little slip and slide, these kids are still having a great time. You get to meet new people, you meet new friends, not just stuck at home playing video games or watching TV. With smaller sized classes offered twice a day, it's an easy and convenient way to spend the summer days. For HCTV, I'm Karen Matsumoto. For more information on class schedules, call the Hawthorne Pool at 1-310-970-7228. It was a summer Christmas for some children in the Hawthorne community. Recently, locals from Hope Chapel gathered for their annual Kids' Day event. The church gave away free school supplies like notebooks, crayons, and other gifts as a way to give back to the community. We just uh, do all we can to get the school supplies, uh, refreshments, games. It's just a, a refreshing way to say that Hope Chapel Hawthorne loves Hawthorne and is here for this city. Kids also enjoyed food and games that were all provided by the Hope Chapel Church. Hope Chapel services begin at 10 a.m. every Sunday and have annual community events throughout the year. For more information, call 1-310-970-9023. The hustle and bustle of daily life can start to wear us all out from time to time, but some Hawthorne residents have found a way to find some inner peace. Recently, I attended the Hawthorne Recreation and Community Services Department's yoga class. Stretch long into your body. One hour each week, these individuals take time to strengthen their mind, body, and spirit through yoga. It's a gift to myself every week. Yoga Basics is a class for all skill levels where students are encouraged to go their own pace. 
yoga is for, is virtually for everybody. We can we can modify poses to to get anybody in. Often we bring in chairs um, to help with certain poses, balance poses up against the wall, or we can make it work for your body. Yoga is great for improving flexibility and balance, building strength, and enhancing self awareness. I just like the way that it makes me feel and the flexibility that I get from it. Another benefit of yoga is the way it makes you feel on the inside. Yoga is a, a meditation and it centers your mind and body. Tara Ann Prock, the class's instructor, hopes her students are able to take something away from each class. Some time to themselves, maybe some serenity to take with them back to their family, some love. Yoga Basics meets every Thursday at the Betty Ainsworth Sports Center. If you would like more information on yoga or any other classes offered, you can call the Recreation and Community Services Department at 1-310-349-1640. Hawthorne Police Chief Stephen Port recently announced his retirement from the Hawthorne Police Force. Chief Port served on the force for the last 32 years. We wish him the very best. Keep it right here on Channel 22 for these future city news stories. We have a lot of new businesses coming to Hawthorne. First, we go to the grand opening of King's Donuts. Also, we check out a new local boutique. And we taste the spicy dishes of Chili Verde. That does it for this edition of City News. If you have any story ideas, please call us at 1-310-349-1630. We leave you now with highlights from the diving class held at the Hawthorne Pool. See you next time.